Hello and welcome to the John Ark Show. Today's episode is called Catastrophic Secrets They're Not Going to Reveal to People. Before we begin, I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Also, we ask that you post a link to today's show on all your social media to help spread the word. Now, let's get started. Most people with an IQ above 50 can sense that they're not being told everything about what's really going on out there and how it affects them. They sense that they're only being given very small glimpses of what's happening and that it's a highly manipulated and distorted and deceptive view of things. So we looked into this phenomena and asked, why aren't people being told the things they need to hear? What aren't companies being told? What aren't many politicians being told? What isn't the news media being told? So we looked into it and here's what our inside sources came up with. These are the areas that people feel they're being told much less about than they need to know. For example, what's really going on with the banks and how bad will things get? Is their money or personal savings at risk of being lost completely? How bad will the wars around the world get? How bad will the job situation and the unemployment become for, for many people? Why are so many businesses closing? The, the rate of closure is accelerating. How much worse will inflation get? Why is crime being allowed to continue to increase and in fact exploding across the country? Why are so many new laws being introduced or passed that seem like they were written by mentally ill individuals? Why are they trying to force out gas-powered cars uh, that work really well and have for almost a century and force the adoption of electric vehicles that don't work in very hot or cold weather and that now cost more to operate than gas-powered vehicles? When will all these wars come to an end? How much worse will California and New York get? How much worse and more challenging will buying or selling a home become? Why is food becoming so compromised? Why do food prices keep climbing? Why do food portions keep shrinking? Why do food ingredients keep getting sketchier and more and more unhealthy? Why do so many people in so many cities no longer feel safe going outside in the day and the evening? Why are so many movie theaters in New York and elsewhere now charging $30 for a movie? What is all that insanity about? It can't just be greed. It's almost self-destructively stupid. Why are the streaming services raising their subscription prices seemingly every 15 minutes and trying to charge more and more for movies that most people have already seen several times in the past? Why are so many 911 operators and so many police officers refusing to send help to people calling for help by claiming that they're understaffed and they don't have anybody to send? Why are so many cities trying to coerce homeowners into renting out rooms in their homes to people from another country with no real ID? Once people do rent out uh, rooms to people from other countries, they will then pass laws and rules preventing them from evicting those people from their homes. Is the home rental initiative just another scam that will cause more headaches for everyday people and homeowners? Why are some places now working on legislation to raise the minimum wage for restaurants to $50 per hour? Isn't that just a new effort to put more restaurants out of business by making their workers unaffordable at 50 bucks an hour? Why are so many news organizations increasingly difficult to believe or trust no matter what they say or show on their screens? Why are there now so many secrets and topics being flashed across so many news channels that people, people really don't believe much of anything they say anymore? People, you've got to be cautious out there because it is getting stranger and stranger and more dubious than ever. You know, the new AI systems and images and audio recordings are getting more and more difficult to believe because they're so incredibly realistic, even though you know they're not. The real question is, when will people start getting more honesty and transparency? Good luck. Thank you for watching. I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Also, we ask that you post a link to today's episode of our show on, on your social media to help spread the word. Thank you, and we shall talk to you soon. Bye-bye.